Dow, interesting uh, story. He has 16 total fights, still just 21 years old. Last time we saw him, though, was over a year ago. So had 16 fights in about two years. Last win was a last fight was a win over Donnie Cox at Turf Wars 25. Coming in with a three-fight winning streak has titles in the Hard Rock, Trotter's Legacy, Turf Wars promotions. Been Pretty all much over every the place. Yeah. Welterweight title there was to win in Kentucky. He has won. Just had a baby. Last night. I did not know that. Last night. He didn't have a baby, but a significant other had a baby. He's a father. Congratulations. Left to way ends to go uh, to go be with his newborn. And Stargell's one of these interesting guys. Maybe the next interesting oh, character. That's what I was going to say. Coming out little of Little R. Kelly, a little bump and grind action. You know on. a little bit about uh, Tom Steele, what kind of character he is. Perry Stargell, the next character coming out of Vision MMA. 2-0. 20 years old is Perry Stargell. You can see him in his uh, picture here. You see the, you know, the jokes and the kind of the lighthearted. Very Dom Steele but, but the guy can fight. Absolutely. We saw him in his second fight take out Justin Collette in 33 seconds. Submission due to strikes. Justin Collette has over 40 amateur fights. For him to even take a fight against a guy like that in his second fight was huge. Now fighting a guy with 16 fights. One of the most dominant guys in his weight class in the area. He just fight anybody. I remember when Brian McDowell early in his career took on two parts. Who's the champ? Didn't do too bad either. Stargell versus McDowell here. Hard Rock MMA 84. Gary Copeland giving out his last few instructions here. Perry Scott. Should be a fun fight here. The stoic Brian McDowell. I did see him crack a little bit of a smile, though, when, the, when Perry Stargell's theme music came on, his entrance music. Loading them up. I expect Stargell is a very fast starter. Two southpaws here. Stargell rushes in first. Coming down back against the corner post there. Throwing a couple knees here early on. McDowell briefly was trying to look for that guillotine. Ooh, big shots from Stargell. He throws everything heavy. See McDowell with the... Channeling some uh, Diaz brothers action there. Wide stance here. This is a big right hook there from Stargell. And that one landed. You see McDowell immediately looking to try to shoot. Stargell take throwing. Bad intentions here in the first round. You see, Stargell does not look like a guy who has two fights on his career. Right. And this is facing a guy in McDowell who has 16.
Nice knee there. Perry Stargell. Dowell now with the pressure up against the cage. Ooh, big left nice hand. Right, yeah, nice stiff jab there from Perry Stargell. And that came fast. The hand speed of Perry Stargell is something special. See him now with the hip right on the back. McDowell has control of the hands. Stargell had one hook in, now has both hooks in on the back of Brian McDowell. We got a minute left here in the first round. Looking to try to flatten him out here. Lock in this rear naked choke. Both hooks in here. Great position for Perry Stargell towards the end of this first round. McDowell trying to shake him off now. Stargell back to his feet. McDowell still trying to fight hands, looking for that Kimura. Ooh, Stargell big throwing. shot. Looked like another right hand landed there. Short time left here in the first round. Stargell grabbing a hold of that neck. Has the guillotine with one arm. 10 seconds left to go here in the first round. It's been all Perry Stargell so far. Nice knee. Not sure if that was low. I can't tell if that was low or not. Referee Gary Copeland gives him a warning. Just a few seconds left here in the first round. And there we go. Round one, all Perry Stargell. Yeah, I think that was pretty clearly Perry Stargell's round. Controlling most of this fight here against a guy who is a veteran fighter in Brian McDowell. See both guys standing in between rounds here, their corners. One more amateur fight. Five pro fights on the night. Stargell coming out, left hands up blazing. He throws with bad intention everything that he throws. Trading knees in the clinch here. Stargell now has the back again of Brian McDowell. Saw this in the first round as well. Stargell again with the hooks in on the back here. Brian McDowell. McDowell going to have to fight this choke attempt again. Stargell with plenty of time here in round number two. Brian McDowell's doing a good job defending these submission attempts, but. Really, the biggest He's thing swimming is he, upstream right now. he wants to make sure he keeps control of the hands, the wrists of Perry Stargell. Perry Stargell needs to work 
try to get one of those arms under the chin of Brian McDowell. Sturgeon now trying to flatten out McDowell. Goes off of the back, back to his feet. McDowell now looking for this guillotine. This looks pretty tight here. McDowell, could this be a huge comeback? He's gonna try to lock in this guillotine. This looks like it might be deep. It's not under the, not completely under the chin though. He cranked that neck. Be top to finish here. Just Cardinals over a minute out. remaining. Finishes that double leg again. On top is Perry Stargell. Just over a minute to go here in round number two. Brian McDowell not out of it yet, but Perry Stargell with another good second round here. Stargell not really looking to pass here, which is interesting. Happy to stay in the guard of Brian McDowell. A couple big shots on the top here. Dow has control of that left arm here. Looks like he might be looking for an arm bar. Nothing doing there. 10 seconds to go here in the second round. Go, 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 go. Stargell starting to turn on a little bit here. A little bit of a slower pace in that second round. I think probably still gonna go for Stargell. He was the aggressor for most of that round again. Had control of Brian McDowell's back. Was on top. Three minutes to go in this 175 pound catch weight fight. So far, so good tonight, David McKinney. A lot of great action. See some good finishes. Well-matched fights. 11 fights in. Great crowd here tonight at Hard Turfway Park. Hard Rock 84. We can call it Hard, Hard Rock Park. Hard Rock Park. Hard Rock Park. Might have to rename it after this. And some T-shirts. And you left out VIP. Set to go here, round number three. Just about set to go. Brian McDowell's corner is already out of the cage. Kick there from Brian McDowell to start off the third round, but Stargell catches it and again ends up on top here. McDowell trying to isolate that arm again, but Stargell just doing a good job here. Staying on top, he has good jujitsu. Good positioning on the ground. McDowell back to his feet. Stargell throws a knee against the cage. Dow has almost a bulldog choke position there, but Stargell pops his head out. Now has the back again. Some peppering shots there through the guard of Brian McDowell. Stargell throws mouthpiece. That looks like McDowell threw Stargell's mouthpiece. I think that was the second time in this fight that Stargell's mouthpiece has come out. Right 
down now looking to try to finish this double leg. A minute and a half left to go here. Starzo is trying to roll through. Didn't even wash it off. Put it in. <laughs> Brian McDowell trying to stay active here in the third round. Have a shot. Ooh, big shot from Brian McDowell. Sturgill, though, ends up on top. Ate those couple of shots and tried to get his position back and did. Less than a minute to go in this fight. If McDowell wants to win, he's going to have to do something drastic here, at least on our scorecards. The pace has slowed dramatically from that first round, a great first round. Gary, this young guy, Perry Starville, coming in, just emerging on the scene here. Absolutely. Super beating, impressive. You know, beat a guy like Justin Collette in his second fight. And if he's able to pick up this win here over Brian McDowell, I think that's going to raise a lot of eyebrows for a guy so young in his career. McDowell unable to get back to his feet. Ten seconds left to go here. Go, Brian, go now. There we go. Into the fight there. Timed it perfectly. Great show of sportsmanship between Brian McDowell. Good fight there, I think. One of the things, and that's a that's a really big win for a guy, at least on our scorecards, I think. For a guy like Perry Stargell over a veteran. And Brian McDowell. Okay. We're going to take a break here right after this fight. We'll get the decision. Wow. It's dedication right there, David McKinnon. So just 21 years old. Guys, we're going to go to the decision here. Take a quick break. Be right back. And there you have it. Perry Stargell, your winner. Don't go anywhere. We're going to stick right here for our main card action coming up. Take a break. Stretch your legs. Get a drink. This is Hard Rock MMA 84 on flowcombat.com. 